so Ted Cruz has been mercilessly mocked by basically the entire internet all day because of this groveling, pathetic photo op he did with Donald Trump down at Mar-a-Lago in Florida. So this is Ted Cruz. You see it up on the screen, trying to smile, pretending like this isn't destroying him inside while Donald Trump has this giant beaming smile because he knows at the end of the day that he's the big dog in the Republican Party and nothing's going to stop him, right? Like, it's just showing that despite the fact that Trump sicked his thugs on the Capitol and is a menace to democracy and lost the last election and lost the Republicans to the Senate, no one's going to stand up to him. And Ted Cruz is no exception. He's bought in whole hog into the coup mentality. He's bought whole hog into the idea that the election wasn't fair mentality. He has led the Republicans on the right against Joe Biden. But you know, this is, it's really just pathetic because as we all remember, Donald Trump was personally cruel to Ted Cruz and to Ted Cruz's family. Like I have a tweet up on the screen right here, which shows just how pathetic Ted is. Remember that Donald Trump multiple times back in 2016 made a point of saying, vote for me. My wife is hot. Ted Cruz's wife is ugly. He would frequently call Ted Cruz's wife ugly, basically implying that Ted was less of a man, less of a leader, less of a, 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 a person to vote for because his wife wasn't hot. Right. And like just absolutely destroying him. He called Ted Cruz the Zodiac killer. He called Ted Cruz's father, the assassin of JFK, all of these baseless, cruel claims that weren't simply ideological or policy disagreements, but an effort to just mock and smear somebody in the political arena. And at the end of the day, Ted Cruz sounded like he was going to stand up to Donald Trump in 2016, but like every other Republican, pretty much, he went crawling back on his hands and knees to daddy Donald because that's what everyone did because they would rather have a little bit of power than any sort of dignity. And AOC called him out as well. AOC couldn't resist because she loves calling out Ted Cruz as we all do saying, isn't it so fun that Donald Trump and, and Ted Cruz got together over dinner and coffee to talk about coups against democracy? Like this is the Republican Party. I know I keep hammering on this, but there's a reason why all of these sorts of photo ops happen. Remember the Romney one from 2016. Luckily, he's come around. But Donald Trump knows that whatever people say, they say they have values. They say they have philosophies that go beyond Trumpism. Fundamentally, to be a Republican means you have to bend the knee to Donald Trump and all of his evil. Ted Cruz knows that and his smile barely hides it.